Hey everyone, welcome back in. So, I have been a little busy re-rolling and re-rolling and going broke and re-rolling at Eli to try to find some specialists. And I found some good ones. We got the Fine Cake Decorator, which produces chocolate from the bakery and increases the bakery productivity by 30%. She is lovely. And I found one that I completely had forgotten about. The Actor. Residences with a variety theater fulfilled are provided with rum and canned food. So guess what? We are about to take care of our problem of not having uh, any uh, canned food. So let's get that put in here. I'm going to want to. I think I'm going to put that right here. Yeah, let's put that in right there. Now, do I have enough? I do have enough to make one of these. Mm, where do I want it, though? I kind of sort of want to move this. Start moving this kind of stuff out of the way, because I don't need it there. So let's put this guy... It's not even. <laughs> it's like the bane of my existence when things are not even. Ah. Okay, you know what? I, I I can I can make this work. There. Although that is a little. It does get way too far down there. You know what? It's fine. It's fine for right now. Let's just go with it. Okay, so now they have their canned food will be taken care of, and their uh, rum need will be taken care of once they need the rum. So that is awesome. We finally have canned food taken care of, and I didn't even have to put in a cannery. That, that's how I like to do it. Uh, let's do a quick bit of a decorating here. We already have a Morris column right there, so I really don't want to put another one in. Let's see, I think this right here will be what I want. We'll put a little statue in right there. A couple of those. Maybe something like this. And on this one right here... We'll just put in some benches. So there we go. Our first little town hall here in the city. I'm good with that. I'll probably I'll probably end up shifting it up a little bit because I don't want it to cover down here so much. All right. Let's uh let's see. We can upgrade a few more people. So let's go ahead and wait. Why are you okay? You're not happy because you don't have enough coverage from him if I move you down here what does that do for it it's be to 94 percent well we can uh, fidget just a little bit come on get to 20 get to 20 there we go go okay let's just go ahead and destroy that one we'll use this one right here for the time being okay new status is a pleasant city, city uh, if you say so queenie it's a little it's a looking a little shabby right now but whatever okay All right, so they want sewing machines and flour, which we have. Okay. So we'll have to have to get a university next. So that is now on the uh, the list of things we need. Let's work on this little spot right here. 
something for the school, for the uh, school kids. Let's check under workers. No. Okay, we'll go under the ornaments then. We'll put that in. And where are those trees at? We'll just put in some medium density. Okay, that didn't look like, that didn't look how I wanted it to. Oh, that's the dead forest. We don't want that. Eh, you know what? I don't care about that right now. Because a lot of this stuff is going to get moved, so. Because I'm not, I'm not feeling some of, I, I don't like when all of the public buildings are going down the center like that. I think it looks unnatural, and it looks a little odd. So I'm probably going to change some of that up at some point. Uh, but first, let's get some of this other stuff done. Now we need a pier, and I believe we have everything we need to make a pier. Yes, we do. Uh, let's see. So I think over here would be a good spot for the pier. Okay. Archie. Okay, pier has been built. Now we need to reach the capital, uh, the city status of capital with 500 engineers. Oh, we need to unload all of these goodies out of there. You were top tail. All right. Let's upgrade some farmers into some workers. Because now it is time to get fur coats online. Ah, good. They have fulfilled the need for that. Look how much we could get if we had beer. There is a specialist that will give me beer, I believe. And I put that in the old world. It's something I kind of did off screen. I was kind of messing around with stuff, I think. Did I put that in? I did. It's right here. It is the uh, Arch Archbishop Archibald. <laughs> uh, residents with a church are provided with schnapps, pub, and beer. And impact of working conditions, minus 35%. If I can get another one of him, then I will also bring him down to the other world, to the uh, Cape Trelawney. I put him in up here just so I didn't have to produce so much beer to save myself a little uh, workforce and money at the moment. So let's get... Actually, we just need to expand until we need for coats supplied. So let's do some, uh, let's do a little expansion here and see what we can come up with in terms of this city. I do want to move a couple of things around that I'm not super keen on at the moment. I'm going to start making our nice main big port up here. Let's get these uh, fisheries put down here. Okay. Let's move the fisheries down there. Is that the, uh, yeah, that's a harbor warehouse. Okay. I'm going to move him over to there. And then I'm going to move him back again right there. That'll work. I like that a little bit more. We do have a decent small amount of bricks I can use to expand our waterfront here a little bit. Now let's think about this whole thing. Because I did want to move this in somewhere neat. Oh, and we had these. I can't remember which one it was now. Just kind of skimming through these real quick, because I thought we had a really neat looking uh, statues and fountains. Oh, where was that thing? 
Yeah, it was underneath this. Here it is. This thing right here is so cool looking. I think it is awesome. I love the look of it. I don't know exactly where I'm going to put it. But I feel like it needs to go somewhere. Wow, I can put it way on out here. Can't I? I wish it lined up perfectly with that, because that would be awesome. And the ships don't exactly fit under it, but, you know, hey, it looks pretty cool regardless, so. Yeah, I, I love that little building. Okay. Let's see here. Kind of looking around, seeing what I might want to use for the uh, the main harbor area here. I think that would look good. Yeah, nice fountain. I like that. Okay. Oh, okay, so that just needs to go like so. This can come out this way. There we go. Good deal. Um, let's. I, I really don't need to be doing this because I could probably sit here and spend all day decorating. It is something I love to do in this game is the decorating. Especially when you have a lot of really cool uh, decorative mods and stuff. Okay. That moves that around kind of where I would like it to be. Um, and these right here. I'm thinking that we're going to use, where's the uh, artisans? Yeah, these right here count as streets. So we're gonna put that down as our main entrance out of that. There we go. Now, I don't want it to just kind of end right there. That looks, a little, uh, that looks a little silly. So let's shift a few people around here. Okay, that'll work. We'll have it lined with, uh, actually, no, 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 we won't have it lined with houses. I have a better idea for what to do along the edge there. We will move a few people around. Little, little shuffle in here. Nothing in this city is safe from my constant rearranging. But I have I have plans, and I think it will look really cool when I'm done. Now, of course, these right here need to be changed into this. Okay, maybe not. Come on. Functions as a street. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Functions as a street. Oh hush, you're fine. Okay, along the edge right here. Oh wait, uh, let's get let's get him out of the way because he is. Uh, let's just put you right there for right now. Now, now I will build and kind of show you what I'm wanting to sort of do. Ideas that uh, several of my viewers in the in times past have given me about making really interesting looking uh, boulevards. And it is finally time for me to make something with that. Because we have some awesome new buildings we can use. Because this is going to go probably straight towards the, um, 
like the center of town and a big main area. Now, as far as the palace, I'm really, really considering the palace back here. The palace would have to go back there by that lake. That is definitely where that's going to go. Okay, so it's going to go like that. We're going to take this right here. Wait, not uh, not that close to it. We'll do it along the back edge, actually. That's why I want it. Right here along the back edge. Yeah. Just like this. Okay, and we'll end it there. Sweet. Now, let's go over here, look at my Ubisoft Club buildings. We're going to grab some of these to kind of flank the different roads out. Like so. Uh, these two right here, oh, no, no, no. These two right here I'm going to get rid of since it's not going to be even, and that's going to be quite all right. And we will put some flags along this side. Yeah, just like that. That's going to look good. Uh, in between, ooh, I do, I do love these little guys right here. I think we'll just uh, put a couple of those. Won't go overboard. I've been told I go overboard sometime with those little planters. But yeah, I love those planters. I really, really do. I wish this right here acted as a street. That would be, like, superb. I, I can't do that right now, Isabella. I am really busy trying to decorate. Ah! Stop that. What did I do? I clicked a, I clicked a button. Okay. Now, get a little something right in between there. Let's see what we've got from our ornaments and stuff that we might could use. Uh, some billboards. Billboards would not be bad. Of course, we only have two. We have a Christmas billboard and a Halloween billboard. I never participate in the, in the uh, Twitch drop events, so I don't have access to any of those really neat-looking Twitch uh, billboards. And some of the Twitch I, uh, items that they come out with. Oh, we do have... Oh, these are tiny billboards. Never mind. What else do we have here? We have these, but I don't like the base of them. Yeah, I'm not, not feeling the base of those. Then, of course, we just have all of this stuff right here. Benches and stuff. No, wait, I think I'm missing something. I'm, I feel like I'm missing some ornaments here, you guys. I am. I'm missing some ornaments, I think. Okay, I'm going to have to go back through my mods, because I've, I've been having a little issues with mods again. I'm going to have to go back through, because I had a ton of mods that had a bunch of really neat city ornaments. So, okay. That is going to be had to be saved for later. I'm going to have to figure out where those have gone to. Oh no, I can't place one right there. Okay, fine, fine, fine. We'll place it right there instead. Oh, not that one. Let's just get this one right here again. And we'll just bring that straight down through there. And that'll work. Uh, I'll also go ahead and just move these up to there. I'll likely put a road in. So there we go. There's the beginning of our Grand Boulevard right here. It's going to be running through town. That's a, actually kind of annoying right there. Huh. That's actually really annoying. It doesn't connect in. It just kind of ends. Huh. That's odd. 
Well, I'll have to remember that. But anyways, yeah, there's the start of the Grand Boulevard. I am going to be very, very pleased with that. Which means I'm going to have to move all this around here now. Eh, that's okay. We can place this kind of stuff anywhere for the time being. And we'll just, just remind me that I have to keep boulevards going. Um, I'm terrible about remembering boulevards. I know you you guys love the big boulevards, the big wide avenues, and I really need to remember to keep those in. So that's something I'm going to be doing, is building these big avenues like that. All right, so anyways, let's get back to the building here. All right, let's see. Let's go up here and work on it from up this direction. Ah, the newspaper is in. What we got? Uh, utterly hopeless. A scarcity of beer in Crown Falls. Let's just cover that up. I think I would like to do a little road layout here as to where everything is going to go. Right to there, I believe. Yes. Okay, so we'll get one right to there. Okay. This guy right here really needs to uh, get out of the way. I'll just use this right here and double this right here up so I remember where the main road is going to go and where this is going to go there to there. What I'm doing right now is I'm kind of laying out like central boulevard areas. We're going to have one that's going to come down this way and probably have like a terminus right down here. And then it's going to continue on up. Now this boulevard right here is not going to be a double boulevard. It's going to be one lane on each side with like a big, probably like a big park type deal going down the center. Be a different type of boulevard. This right here will likely end uh, a terminus at the World's Fair right up in this area. That's probably how I'll do that. And then it will branch out again off of the World's Fair. That's how I think I want that right there to look. This main road right here that's cutting across, I could likely widen that. Um, I probably can go ahead and widen that. We'll make a boulevard right here as well. That will change out the layout of some of this right here, though. Do I really want to do that? Possibly not. Instead, what we could do is... Let's think real quick. How could I do that? I get this road right here. Bring it over to right there. Cut this road out. Remember, I'm trying to go for, you know, I, almost like a planned city, very, uh, okay, you know what, you can just, you can just go and get out of my way. There we go. We can bring that down. We'll move these guys out of the way for the moment. We can bring him right to there. Now, it does not have to in go this way and intersect or anything. I don't have to do that. Bring that straight on down. Okay, well, we can put the variety theater there. Let's see. We can move this. And put a house there. We can put a house right there. We could do something like so. Yeah. 
How are we feeling about that? We like that. And then right here in front, we'll do, oh, not those. Those are too big. Maybe use some of our new little uh, designs that we have. I'm loving these new box, these uh, tall boxwoods. And these like little topiary bushes. Absolutely loving those. They look superb. What else do we have here? We could do some columns. What else do we have? Statues, just some just some blank paving. Nothing wrong with having blank paving. All right, let's get some of our other road types put in here. Start getting the city looking like, you know, it's supposed to. This right here I'm going to have to deal with somehow because that's actually kind of bothering me. That's really bothering me right now. All right, I think we've got something going on here. It's starting to look like how I'm envisioning it. Yeah, this is starting to look good right here, I think, guys. It's going to look good. I like the houses butting up to the uh, hedgerows right here. Some nice, uh, nice wide open spots everywhere. We can expand this park right here down a little bit then. Let's go ahead and do that. Kind of make this park a little bit bigger. Okay, let's see. Oop, not that. Uh, we had the little flowers and stuff. And we have... Maybe we'll put this park right here into the front of it. There we go. There, nice little, nice little park thing. Uh, I did just think about it. We do have, and I forgot. I've got to remember which parks I use on everything now. This is going to uh, take a little time to remember which parks I use. No, not the statue. That one. That one has the uh, ground color that I'm looking for. What I'm actually thinking about doing right here, change this up slightly. And I'm thinking about using some of the uh, Ubisoft. Oh wait, no, those are the, the, these promenades have the, those edges on them, Never mind. Instead, we'll just use the uh, Nam Park paths. There we go. And we will terminate those on each end right there. Get rid of whatever is going on right there. Put in a couple of trees right there. That'll work. And the brick roads to finish it off. There we go. A little bit nicer park right behind the uh, the city hospital. Get our artisan right there. And that's starting to look good right there. I like it. Okay, now that we have some uh, some ideas of where everything needs to be fitting in at, I can spend a little time now expanding the city. Okay, it looks like some stuff doesn't fit quite perfect right in there, and that's okay. I can leave that open, actually, because we likely will need things like more uh, police stations or 
um, other buildings and stuff that we might want to put up there later on. So I will leave that blank for the time being. Get a few houses in over there. Let's upgrade some of those and let's get some of these guys right here upgraded. Wonderful. Now we have unlocked all of the uh, artisan buildings and we are just a little, uh, a few shy of needing the fur coats dealt with. So let's go ahead and think about the fur coats. Where did I have fur? Right here. Cannot wait to go to the Arctic and unlock the, uh, the much better hunting cabins in the Arctic. That's going to be a godsend. But until then, we're going to have to deal with these hunting cabins. Let's upgrade that into a worker yeah what did we think about the uh, idea so far i'm going to try to lay out a lot of the road system and the road network as we go and leave room for big boulevards and big wide areas all right let's just grab some wood uh do i need what else do i need it's just the wood for that okay we're also going to need cotton in the new world, so we need to, once we have this right here set up, we will go to the new world and set up cotton. Probably going to get four of these to start and get two fur dealers. one these things can be placed very close together three you can take all the four no not allowed lady not allowed okay and we will put in one of those right here let's drop off the last bit of that we'll go up to here Now let's run over back to the old world and let's grab a schooner. We will just make a quick schooner to transport the fur. And now let's go to the new world and we'll get ready for cotton. Uh, cotton can be built, it looks like here, on Las uh, Bernanderas. And I'm thinking we're just going to put the cotton trade back in the back. Maybe like right back in here somewhere. Okay, let's get cotton started. We're going to need one of these. So it's two cotton plantations to one cotton mill. And it is one cotton mill to one fur dealer. So I, I'm going to need at least, let's say, three cotton Whew. yeah let's say at least three cotton mills because i just want to make sure i have enough so we're gonna need two four six of these At least until I get the costume designer uh, specialist, which will allow me to not have to deal with these anymore. Okay, the, uh, the costume designer, if you're not familiar, is a specialist you can find that replaces the need for linen cloth with uh, wool from sheep farms. It really makes the whole process of having to deal with uh, fur coats a whole lot easier. Uh, who's riding and why? Can I ask that question? Uh, I'll deal with it in a second. Hold on. Let me get one more cotton plantation put down here.
Okay. People are riding somewhere. Uh, okay, they're riding over there. Why, I don't know. But they are. Um, Alright. Police station back there, then. And we will uh, have them deal with the riots. That will be fine. Alright, we need another clipper. Or do I want to do a barkentine? I can't remember which is faster. I think that is slightly faster, but we'll just stick with a clipper for right now. This strike has ended. Yeah, that's already over. That's fine. Okay, Cape Trelawney. Create a route from there to there. Oh, trade route from here to here. Uh, a ship we're going to use, it looks like the Franklin is the ship I want to have. Load up fur and unload the fur. Uh, we have some quests, not opposed to a few quests. Ooh, commemoration day. Lovely. Uh, a puzzle quest, we have to find the artist's apprentice. There he is. And we got a damaged statue. Okay, well that's going to get sold because that's pretty pretty useless right there. Okay. So, now that we have all of this right here going, and we will have some love... Oh, we already have lots of cotton fabric being brought uh, brought in for us. I believe, doesn't she sell cotton fabric? No, 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 no. She sells sugar, cocoa, and sugar cane. Alright, where is... Let's speed things up real quick and get this clipper out so we can start bringing in uh, linen up to Cape Trelawney. Come on, three, come on. Five, four, three, two, one, boom. Okay, you are going to pick up uh, plenty of this, and you are going to take it to Cape Trelawney. Okay. Um, oh, looks like we are in need of some more goodies up here. So that's all good, that's all good. That's fine. All right, sausages. We need some sausages. Yeah, I only have one at the moment. Let's get up here and get our sausages put in. One, two, three, four, five. And sausages. Let's upgrade both of those. Okay, what else was we running out of? Was we? Look at that. That is like some epic speak speech right there. Was was we? All right, and one more bakery. That should take care of it because we had everything we need to support two bakeries. Yep, yeah, sausages are now fine. Everything else is looking good. We're not worrying about beer because um, just not worrying about beer. What do you have for me? A uh, diving bell quest for 20k. You know what? I'll take that. Uh, find a ruined drill. Okay. So the first possible location was right there. Still don't trust you. Eh, it'll be fine. 
So those two things right there should take care of themselves here shortly. Once uh, We need to wait for them to be filled up so we know how close we are to needing fur coats. There you are. All right, found it. Let's get that back. We, we've picked up a ruined drill. A mountain of lint. <laughs> Gotta love him. Okay. Yeah. Get a little money. Always love a little extra money in my pockets. got a nice supply of fur in we just have to wait for that cotton fabric to come in so we can make our fur coats yeah we have to do something like that And we probably won't do that. We'll leave this right here open. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta go find. We're missing a mod. I'm missing a mod. I gotta go find the one I'm missing. Look at that. We're up to forty-two twelve right now. Nice, sizable income coming in. Got a decent. Uh, oh, we got a decent uh, uh, stockpile of money at the moment with five hundred thousand. We have everything coming in to hopefully soon. Let's go ahead and upgrade maybe one more. Yeah, now we can unlock. Well, now we've unlocked fur coats. Get up to fifteen hundred, and we'll unlock the need for the university, and we'll finally be on our way to engineers, which I believe engineers unlocks the Arctic. And the Arctic is going to be an area that I want to get to and do that quest as soon as possible, so we can unlock the new types of hunting cabins and several things that that comes with that's going to be very helpful to supply a huge population that we're going to have across all of our islands but i think that's going to be it for me today i hope you all have enjoyed our little uh we, we didn't expand too much but we're we're getting there quickly um trying to get up to where i can supply them with everything they need so we can get up to engineers in the next episode, and in the next episode, we will work on supplying all of their needs to get up to investors as quick as possible. So, hope you will join me for that. Thank you so much. So many new subscribers here lately. If you have not subscribed and you're watching my videos, I actually looked the other day, and like 60% of the people watching my videos have not subscribed. So, if you haven't and you want to keep watching, uh, watching me play and watching me build my uh, very non-efficient but ultimately will be a very neat looking city go ahead and hit subscribe and i will see you in the next one take care guys